Big nose gang, I have some news for you, and it might be shocking. It shocked me. I, Pete, of Pete's Vlogs Fame and Notoriety, have been called out. That's right, called out! I have been challenged by controversial UK YouTuber, Finn Ellis, if that's even her real name, which it is, I, go I googled it. Young Finley Ellisey has double, triple doggy dared me to see if I can replicate a whole face makeup thing that she's invented. And you know what? You know what? I don't ever say no to a challenge. Now the rules are as follows. I have to do it all by myself. But, and that's a big old but, I am allowed to have my girlfriend in the sidelines kind of giving me pointers, because I'll be honest with you, this video will be about three hours if I have to figure out the name yeah. of each makeup item myself. Am I nervous? You got that right, I'm nervous. Does it matter? No, because I never back down from a challenge, so we're doing it. Okay, so full disclosure, Finn's not a controversial YouTuber. She's a YouTuber from the UK. Uh, I'll link her channel down at the bottom here in this little description box. And she makes makeup videos and two videos on coins. You should watch them. Okay, so Finn sent me a video uh, with a bit of a tutorial on what I'm supposed to be doing. And I've got my beautiful Hannah behind the camera and she's gonna be pointing at the things and passing me things so I don't muck it up. All right, Finley, what do you got for me? All right, Pete, I hope you're ready. I am ready. <laughs> You don't have this issue because obviously you have short hair, but the first thing you're going to do is tie your hair back or put a cute little headband in. So if you've got a headband, go and do that, but you don't need to. You have short hair. Yeah. No, repeat. What do you mean? <laughs> have you ever watched Star Trek? It's like Geordie. <laughs> Push it forward more. Why is it so sharp? Yeah. We're going to be going for a very halloween -y inspired look today we're using purples, oranges and greens. My Halloween-y. Halloween inspired look today we're using purples, oranges and greens. Maybe a little bit of black, depends how wave I feel. So the first thing you're going to do, or you're going to want to do, is start off with your clean base. Make sure you've got no excess oil on your skin, give it a little baby wipe if you need to. Have I done that? Yes, we did that just before. Yes! So your first step is going to be to use a primer, get any primer you want. I'm going to be using the Maybelline Face Studio one. Pop mm. a tiny little bit of that on your fingers and then just smooth it into your skin. Because it is a crime not to prime. Well, I don't want to break the law, so let's do it. Whoa! So put a little bit on your finger. I'm priming. I don't know what the heck a primer does. Aside from smell amazing, <laughs> what the hell is this? Go it's do a that. coconut. <laughs> you just put it on so then your makeup stays. Oh, that's brilliant. That's bullshit. Being a boy sucks, eh? We don't get any of this stuff. I get to walk around smelling like a coconut. <laughs> but always does this with her hand behind the product. I don't know why. It's so it focuses on the product and right. not in the background. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> you learn something new every day. It's not just makeup, you do anything. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Silly goose. Right, next up you're going to want to get your foundation. Get one that matches the shade of your neck. Um, and if it doesn't, then learn how to blend it in. But I'm going to be using my W7 one. Pop a tiny little bit of this on your hand and then spread that all over your face. Is my neck the different colour to my face? Yeah. Hold on, she gave me some advice. Avoid your lips. I never do. If you can, try to avoid your lips. Yeah, you can use that. So how do I... So I put this on my face? Yeah. Just imagine it's like a crayon. Beats. Vlogs. I feel like war paint. Okay. And then I use this, do I? Get to... Yeah, nice. This is quite fun, isn't it? Painting your face. I feel like I'm at the fear. Alright then, done foundation. Right, once that's done, you're going to have to take your clean powder brush before you put any powder on it. Just pat around your face, get rid of as much of the shine as you can without the powder. I'm going to be using some loose powder. Pop a tiny little bit of this into the lid. Loose powder. I swear she lives in like a tropical rainforest. island. Rainforest? Yeah, rainforest. There's always birds in all her videos. It's so funny. Okay, so hold on. And then you're going to pat that into your foundation so that it makes it a bit more matte, lasts a bit longer. Oh, I've used too much there. You don't want that much. A little bit in the lid. Pat, pat, pat. And then pat it all over your face. This doesn't smell like anything. You gotta pat it real hard. I don't know what you what do you mean pat? Pat's a soft tap. Thing. Tap. I gotta put this on my face too. Tap it. Before you put it on, tap it onto the lid. Yep. Okay now. Yep, just put it Everywhere? on. Everywhere? Yep. <coughs> Got some powder in my mouth. I look damn good. Let's go, next step. Because I am very much sleep deprived and I've got little bags under my eyes, I'm going to be using a little bit of concealer. You can use any one you want, but this is the W7 HD one. 
I'm going to pop a tiny little bit under my eyes and blend it in. You don't need a lot. No one wants those clown triangles. You don't need it. Like, that's plenty. That's actually maybe too much. And then I'm going to use the same brush because I'm lazy and I can't be bothered to get up and change it. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, all right. So, she did a little stuff. Oh my God, what is this? Under the eye? Yeah, but not much. I feel like I'm going to a festival. I quite like painting. How am I doing, Finn? Huh? Uh, it feels weird. Oh, why does my mouth keep doing that? <laughs> <laughs> you look like that freaking Pan's Labyrinth, like the guy with the hands as the eyes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and it's like crime, not the prime. What's the next step, Finley? You didn't have to flick your nose. I just, I don't know why I do that. I just do it all the time. <laughs> Big nose gang. Yes! What is this? And then no, 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 no. There's no there. We do the old that is my nose. <laughs> Even though really, everyone asks me that, they're like, you always go a big nose game and do the thing, and they're like, what is that? I'm like, that's a nose. Finley, what's next? For a tiny little bit of HD definition, mm -hmm. and to make it appear as though I own some cheekbones, I'm going to be going in with a mini Benefit Huda, which is a what is this? It's a Bronzer? <laughs> it's a bronzer. We're going to be using bronzer. bronzer. Chucking a little bit of that in the dent. Like that. Then blend it out. Blend up. Swift, swift, swift. Swift, swift, swift. Do I have a dent or am I too fat? Where's the dent? I don't see a dent on You can on make face. one by like that. Yep. And keep blending. If you think it's blended enough, keep going. Do it on the other side so we don't look wonky. Okay, and now and my dent. So go and fish. Yeah, and do in the bits in here. No, 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 Pete. What? Up here by your ear. Yeah, around there. I feel so weird. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta keep blending it, because if you think yeah. you blended it enough, room has it, you ain't. Yeah. How am I supposed to do this with my left hand? You can use your right hand. Oh. <gasps> my comfort zone? I'm out of it, but you know what? I'm having a good time. My face feels heavy. Next. Okay, I'm not good at contouring. I really, really hope that you are, but I'm not. So that- I- I'm- I've got you. I'm good at contouring. What the f*** is contouring? Oh, but I'm <laughs> So, the next stage we're going to do is put our cheeks back on. Where did my cheeks go? Where did my cheeks go? <laughs> this is so confusing. Okay, we're good. Let's go! Take a blusher palette. You can take any blush you want. And I normally go in with a lighter shade, so I'm going to mix these two together and pop that on the apples off my cheeks. If you don't know what the apple is, just do one of those little weird half-assed smiles. Okay. Oh, I got apples! Mm -hmm. Got a colour in my apples. This one's called Fire Witch. I like that. Tap tape. Oh my god, Pete! What? What are you doing? What do you mean? You're supposed to put it up here. I thought I was doing my apples! I have to do a smile thing. <laughs> then what's next? You probably don't need to do this because most men have perfect eyebrows anyway and it's not fair because you don't even use them. Who uses them? What do you use them for? I have so many questions! I'm going to take an eyebrow pomade if you don't want to use one of these or if you'd rather use a powder you can use that. And an eyebrow brush, if you can see. So yeah, I'm going to take these two. Pop a little bit in there. The Take bird's gone mental on the background. Do you hear that bird? And then fill in your eyebrows. Oh. So they don't look too fake. Get the end of the spoolie brush. What the hell's a spoolie brush? Okay, let's start with this. <laughs> Do that one first. I've got the thickest freaking eyebrows in the world. What am I doing this for? What the hell is the point in this? <laughs> I just drew a line there. <laughs> What's the spoolie brush? I'll give it to you in a sec. Okay, I was not very good at coloring within the lines when I was a kid. I know. <laughs> Why do I, what is the point of making me look even Greeker? I just <laughs> look angry now. Who named the spoolie brush? And then so they don't look too fake, get the end of the spoolie brush. We'll get the spoolie end of the brush and just brush them through. This has got goo on it. What the? This just seems super unnecessary. My eyebrows look thick as hell. This is where the saying comes in. They are sisters. They are not twins. They never will be twins. Mine are conjoined twins. In fact, most of most of my life, the long 
distant cousins, <laughs> to be completely frank, but I'm quite happy with those. They're all right. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to move on to the eyeshadow. Now, I already said we're doing this kind of Halloween themed. We're using some brights. So we're going to be using the bright green, the orange, uh, this purple, and then maybe a part of a black in another palette. So now we get to put some colour in. Mm -hmm. Cool. So first things first, you're going to take the nude colour, which is basically a skin toned colour, and pop that all over your crease. What's going in my crease? Right, oh, that's my crease. Let's do it. Nudie colour, please. Please send nudes. These are my nudes. Just in here? Yeah, high up. High up? Yeah. I can't see when I do that. Okay, great. If you're scared to draw the line, just get a little bit of product and just use a little bit to start with and then build it up. I'm not scared of nothing, Finn. This one is orange. There. Oh, there's a little mirror down here too. Oh, that's quite neat, isn't it? Oh, no. oh wow. Oh, a lot comes off. Oh, that's a lot of... Whoa. Okay. I look like a super villain. This is super weird. I feel like Finn's like gonna critique how I'm holding the brush. <laughs> She's gonna be like, what are you doing, mate? Oh yeah, it's a bit of purple. Okay. Show them the purple. Oh yeah, yeah, sorry. That purple. She we does. can get the, the orange brush that we used and just oh, do a bit, a bit more. Am I putting enough on? I feel like hers is way more colourful than mine. Do you think it's not dark enough? That's good. <laughs> it's like arts and crafts, eh? But on your face. How do I do for my first blend? Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Ah! All right. I, my blending is not great today. I don't really know what has happened, but that's what you should hopefully end up with a little bit. Then you're going to take a smaller brush and you're going to go in with the green. And we're going to put green on the lower lash line. This cringes some people out, so hopefully. Her orange is a lot lighter than my orange. You will probably get eyeshadow in your eye. Normally, no. The process. <laughs> No, I don't want. Whoa! No, I'm not. I don't want to do that. That looks super yuck. No offense. Onto the thumb. I mean, it looks good. Like the makeup looks good. I just the act of doing it makes me unhappy. Which color? She went green. So I think the closest green I've got is that green there. Know that? Oh, what the shit! Oh, oh my god, that sucked. Have I done it right? I hated that whole experience. To the other way. I'm butchering this, eh? I don't want to do that anymore, so that's enough. Onto the thumb part, which you're probably going to hate. We're going to do some eyeliner. Some liquid eyeliner. Mm -hmm. This is one of those things where you're either perfect or you're not to begin with. Great. You either have like beginner's luck or you're going to end up with eyeliner everywhere. So, I'm going to break it down. We have our eyeliner. It's like a felt tip pen and you are going to draw over your lash line flick up a little bit and then connect the flick to the line. Does that make any sense? Make a point where you want your eyeliner to stop. Draw a line. What? And then there's your flick. You now need to draw from the inner corner and then join it up. Okay. Uh, I can do that. I'm cool with that. I'm not mad. There we go. Okay, so that's kind of something a Batman would do, so I can kind of get on board. Where's the pen, Hannes? Well, okay. Good. I look like a nut job. That's unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Hey, that's not too bad. Yeah? Yeah, move on to the next eye. Don't keep going. Oh yeah. shit, I got some up there. <laughs> oh, I look like a train wreck. I do feel a little bit sexier though. <laughs> Okay, well, I butchered the shit out of that. Sorry, Finn. Have I made it worse? <laughs> Just leave it. <laughs> I feel like a shit superhero. Next step is mascara. I'm not going to chuck false eyelashes on you because I hate them myself. So I'm not going to subject you to that sort of torture. Mm -hmm. But you're going to grab any old mascara and just pop it on your lashes, brushing up or down, whatever ones you're going to do. And it's mandatory whenever you do mascara, you have to pull the mascara face. So this is like a little hairbrush for your eyebrows, eyelashes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, god damn it. Look at the size of this thing. 
Look at the size of this <laughs> thing. Oh, that does good. <laughs> oh, I'm getting it on my nose. <laughs> so, PNG. Yeah. Big nose game. I, I look like I've had a rough night out, eh? <laughs> Put it on your nose. Like. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you know, I've got a newfound respect for James Charles and I guess all well, those other human beings who do this for a living, clean thing. We've only got two more things left, so the next thing I'm going to do is chuck on a dark lipstick. My one is like this reddy colour, it's just like a dark red. I want to go dark because it's Halloween themed. Let's go. So it's just like lip balm, I can do this one. I look like a bag of shit, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> hey, I'm, I'm even bad at this part. This is really hard. I can't believe, like I'm actually, I can't believe how hard this is. And then very, very lastly, as if this isn't enough on your face, I'm gonna be taking some purple glitter and popping the glitter on my cheekbones where I'd normally put my highlighter, but this is like Halloween party, isn't it? So. We're going to take a tiny bit of glitter and just pop it underneath. I have a very different kind of glitter. Your glitter is dry glitter. Ooh. That's cool. I want to use that. I look confused, eh? This is this is off. Oh, I look alright. The headband was maybe ruining the look. Hi, hey, baby. Right, Pete, and there you have your Halloween coloured inspired eyeshadow look. I literally cannot wait to see how you get on. I really, really wish you the best of luck. Um, I hope you don't look too stupid, but I'm used to looking like this, so you won't. I'm sure you're going to do fine. The last, last, last step ever is the mandatory selfie. You have to take a selfie with a sassy face ready for Instagram. That's your last step. So enjoy, and I will see your Instagram post very soon. Mm. Bye. Thanks, Finn. There's one thing that we need to finish the look. What do you think? Same? Same, same? I, uh, I don't know how I feel about all this. I'm not gonna lie. This is a, this is, was a unique experience uh, for me. This is really hard. Like, it was really, really hard. I can't believe how hard it was. Big ups, Finn. I don't know how you do it every week. Twice a week sometimes. I imagine girls do this every day. <laughs> Am I pretty? Fabulous, darling. Thanks, babe. Oh well, thanks everyone for watching. If you like this video, subscribe, leave a comment, click the like button, ring the bell, do a dance, share it on Facebook. G give me a call. Just call me on the telephone. Tell me, tell me you liked it. And also check out Finn's uh, YouTube channel because she actually makes this stuff look effortless. And I'm not gonna lie, it is, it is rough. I look like Courtney Love. <laughs> Don't forget, if you wanna join the Big Nose Gang, <laughs> click the subscribe button. Um, and become a member of the family. It's free. It's free to join and we accept noses of all shapes and sizes. Tiny little noses like Finn's nose or enormous big old noses like this. Uh, schnoz. Everyone's welcome. Alright, sweet. See you later. When you're walking down the street and you're